Hey guys, this is Cyrus. I'm not sure where I left off in this game, but I'm pretty sure it was right here. So, a few months later, <laughs> uh, we met back up with Kenny, and we're at the lodge that he's been at. So, I just need to examine everything and prepare for a devastation. As far as any other setup things, if, I, I don't know if you watch any other series or if you're new here, but uh, there should be a... Actually, no, that it won't be relevant to, by the time people see this. It's going to be hard to keep track of, so I won't even mention it. <laughs> so let's just get into this uh, Cousin Jared's CD. concert, October 13th, 1998. Um, how do we, we put this in? Let's listen. It it works. I hear sounds coming from it. Huh. That's alright. Reminds me of school. This is school. The school of hard knocks. You will learn many a thing here, child. So let's see what else there is to explore, though. It won't let me go to the lab, so it... There's no money in the cash register. What's this song you're humming? Good King Wenceslas. It's my favorite Christmas song. What's it about? I haven't what? seen one of these it's since... It's about a king that brings food to a poor man. King and his servant march all night through a cold winter storm to reach the land. Mm -hmm. The storm is very strong. After a long time, it gets so cold that the servant can't go on. But the king tells the servant to just step in his tracks. Mark my footsteps, prove my page, tread the okay. wind boldly. Thou shalt find the winter's bridge. Please let us that cold breeze. I don't get it. <laughs> it means that doing good things for people can be good for you too. But the servant would I want to see your conversation, but I kind of want to talk to you. <laughs> Good point. Okay. Clem, we could use some help. Here, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. String them up! Hmm. Not you words I like Kenny to hear. Before. It must be incredible to see him again. When I met him, well, he's so different now. But you must be so glad. So... How'd you meet Kenny? I found him holed up in an old restaurant, if you can believe it. Holed up? You should have seen his beard then. Perfect. Now <laughs> we just need the topper. Must have Beale been a lot like Rick Grimes. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations. Find the, find a tree topper. Can I use my lighter and put it up there? It'll be like lit. What a funny little guy. He ain't said nothing funny. There's nothing funny about him. He happens to be one of my best friends and doesn't like to be joked about like that. And say updated my journal. Let's look at the fireplace. Looking at fire makes me warm. Also feeling the fire. Feel the burn. Okay, uh there has to be something else in here somewhere. What are we looking for? I'm gonna assume whatever I'm looking for is gonna be upstairs. Because that's it for everything down here. Damn, you can't run? I'd be running in this. It's crazy. Why would they follow us this far? You can't be sure. It's been a week, man. We gotta be out of the woods. We can't be sure. They might be tracking us. Tracking? Who do you think they are? Ninjas? Maybe. Clem, Luke said you saw some people in the valley. People? Way down there. How? She's got binoculars, genius. Yeah, yeah. I saw lights. Which way did they go? Back I don't even the remember. We 
cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight, right? Maybe. Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We have to be careful. He mentioned someone else. Someone else? Who? His friend. His name is Matthew. Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. I'm gonna go find Luke. I don't exactly I trust don't you. So Beck, what's wrong? I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. As I, I mean, I don't remember much, but I don't trust the people that I've been traveling with. Can I talk to you for a moment, Rebecca? I don't trust you, you okay? the most. Just got a little dizzy. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I mean, how can anyone now? Everything's so fucked up. It's not gonna be easy. I know it's gonna be hard. No, you don't. But at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely. Because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. She's kicking. You wanna listen? Maybe. That food smells <laughs> good. Huh? It's okay. Can I? She's gonna be a runner. This is gonna be a useful skill if you don't die. If he finds out it's not his, he'll kill you. I don't know what to do. I can't believe I'm asking a little girl for advice. But I guess nothing's weird anymore. He won't kill you. There's my man. You all right, baby? I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in you. Thanks for staying with her, Clem. Can you go ask that Walter guy when we're going to eat? I, uh, I, I, he, he might. He, he might. I hate it when you call me that. He I might know, kill her. But I, I, mean. I love you, too. You get some rest now. Was this the topper we was looking for? Uh, yes, yes, there, there. That's nice, I guess. Beautiful. Oops, that was the wrong one. I used to love this time of year. I you messed know, up. That That's not the one she wanted. Here, this place is starting to feel like a real home. Matthew and Walter are amazing people. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. The first time he met me, he called me Rita. So I call him Maddie now. Where is Matthew? Oh, he likes to go on long walks. He and Walter used to vacation here. He should be back soon. Clem, I wanted to ask you. Does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before, and, well, I'm curious. He has good days and bad days like everyone else. He seems like the same old Kenny to me. Oh, well, that's good. Well, you three have that's been busy. Kenny, isn't it great? I got it. I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Always has to play the gentleman, but I'll tell you when I met him he couldn't lift a fly Well everyone dinner is sir something bad is about to happen. Oh god I messed up the ornament oh. Killed his Wait, wait Anybody worried about Matthew? You okay, man? Yeah, I just... I wish I hadn't pulled that trigger. Just try to forget about it. Right here, Clem. Make me choose? Well, I'm gonna sit with Kenny. Here you go, Clem. So, Clem, we were just talking. What's the deal with the kid? What's his name? Luke? He in charge? You trust him? Kenny, please. Sarita, we don't know these folks. 
They seem nice. Yeah, well, gators seem nice too till they bite your damn arm off. I like him. He's a good guy. Would you trust him with your life? I think so. Maybe. That guy, Big Al, he said they were on the run. Some people are after them. Well, you don't have to worry about that no more. They'll go tomorrow and you can stay here. Absolutely. Honey, you stay with us as long as you want. She's staying for good. If that's what she wants. Of course she does. Right, Clem? Thank you. Of course. This is like a dream. Damn it, I am so happy right now. I, I can't even tell you. What's up with the musical chairs here? Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's... it's great. Thank you. Peaches and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out, though, I tell ya. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, DMA. Well, good to see you, so Joker. So, it's Luke and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the winter? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? No. Wellington? The hell is that? A place. What kind of place? Yeah. Krista and I were going there. Supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land, and cold ass winter, so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, vanilla ice. I don't know what your deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. That'd be just fine by me. What's the deal with these guys, Clam? Hey, fuck you, buddy. It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. She's staying. What? <laughs> Excuse me? You heard me. Please, don't fight. Stop Gentlemen, please. Fight. There's Stop no the need fight. for this. Now look, we've all had a long day. Please eat. Pass me that can, duck. <gasps> duck? Who's duck? Hey Clementine, would you uh, lend me a hand outside for a moment? I see being back has caused more problems than necessary. That's that's bad. Uh, I'm sorry about that. You know, I used to be a teacher, and I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. It may take a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. Listen, relationships are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. What do you say? Will you help me work on them? The two of us must unify our factions for the common good. You know, like Churchill and Roosevelt. They say the world is over. But I'll tell you a secret. It's not. It might be with the People way we keep acting. People are political now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck. Have you read him? No. Well, we have plenty. Like, of who do you think I am? My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature. Class. I think you'll like him. In any case, the point is, as long as we have our wits about us, we can always make the right choice. Right? I think that's where things... Uh, right! What's the matter, Clementine? Is there something you want to tell me? You can talk to me, Clem. There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. Yeah. I promise you that. Let's... I'm worried about your friend. I think that... Don't worry. Matthew will be back soon. And 
everything will be fine. But I think... Hey, kids, what are you two talking about? Oh, politics. The hell? Well, being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. I was just gonna check the windows round back before this storm hits. Give us a hand? Sure. Miss? Wait, I recognize her. Please, do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss... Bonnie. Wasn't she from what? one of the little... Know. You're just gonna let her in like that? It's fine. The DLC? I can't don't remember. Know this girl. Then we'll have to get to know her. Right, Clem? Walt. How much damage can this poor woman do? Check her for weapons. Yeah. Thank you. Really, but that storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something out to you then. You don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. What about your people? We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. But she didn't go with the group of survivors, so... There's no telling her what it I have is. she her? Little girl like you. Was she from the DLC? I can't remember. How old are you, sweetie? I'm eleven. I would have thought older than that. Here you are, miss. This is too much. Don't mention it. I don't know how to thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. You stay safe. You too. Clem, go on inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. He's too friendly with the... I mean, sure, it's nice. It's a nice thing to do, but... It's too risky to be Look giving down. up supplies like that and whatnot. Don't freak out. What do you want? Listen. I gotta tell you something. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. Oh, God. See, I knew something was off, so I asked Sarita about their friend. Now they're all worried he's not back yet. I know he was. For sure. Damn it. Damn it, Nick. I don't think Walter knows yet, so we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out. Mm. We should tell him. He's gonna ask who did it. And you're gonna tell him. It's the right thing to do. It's right to get Nick killed because that's what's gonna happen. Now, do you, uh, you still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. Okay, well, go get rid of it. And I'll find Walter and run interference. Oh, and, uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Oh, uh, there's nothing, man. I just wanted to... Check and see if you're okay. You coming to tuck me in? No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, Lies yeah, is not something. the way to do this. We, have to we need consequences. Something. There has to be consequences. Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. We can't keep secrets. No, just go back to bed, Nick. I'm serious. You guys can talk to me. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, God. God damn it. Hey, Nick, shut the fuck up. I can't, man. I can't. Do not fucking blow it. Blow it? It's over. I have to tell him, Luke. What? No, you can't. Hey, Nick, you cannot do that. Are you fucking nuts? I gotta. I can't live with that on me. Okay, I hear you, but f I mean, fuck, man. Do you know what he's gonna do? You don't know he'll do anything. Well, are you kidding me? Nick, you shot his friend. Either way is risky. Exactly. Jesus. I can't handle this. Look, Clem, just go do that thing, all right? Could I, could I opt to not do that thing? Uh. 
It's gone. Uh oh. like this knife gave it to Matthew when all this started I know he's dead who did it was it that that kid what's his name uh, Nick I heard him talking earlier something about shooting a man I could see it I could see it on his face I wasn't sure then but now? It was us. It was our fault. Jesus. I, um... Uh, I don't feel good. Nick shot him. Nick a good man or is he just like everyone else he is a good guy he he's is. just he's a good guy Walter he was always going out alone I told him something like this would happen but he wouldn't listen no Matt always knew best what's going on you need to tell him tell him what what happened on the bridge Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, I, thought, I thought he was going to shoot my friends, and I I shot Matthew. But it, it, it happened real fast. I didn't, I didn't know if I hit him, but I did, and I didn't mean to. Do you know what you've done to me? Do you have any idea? Maybe. I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter. Okay, that Whoa. wasn't What's going on? so bad. Wait. The storm's got it spinning out of control. That sound's gonna draw walkers. We gotta shut it down now. Nick, help me. Carry the guns. Guns? That thing's a damn dinner bell. This is gonna be bad. There's, there's. All right, at least he didn't kill the dude though. So far, he handled it pretty well. Damn it! Transformer must have gone. Gotta check it. I could use a hand. I'll go with you. I'm going to. No, it's too dangerous. The rest of you, get this thing shut down. I'm curious to see what the achievement was, though. Does anyone know how to do this? No. Wait. There ain't no electrician. Wait, what? Okay, we'll watch your back. Nick, scan the trees. With Clementine, what did I tell you about volunteering me for shit? <sighs> One second, let me see uh, if I can figure out. Settled things with a new friend. Okay. We, we did things. This doesn't seem like the right thing to do, but it's all we got. The key goes in here. It was that simple. 
Okay. Wait. I hear something ain't right. Yeah. The sounds of the dead arise, my minions. <laughs> we don't have much ammunition. We gotta get back to the lodge. They're behind us. We don't need to be shooting here. We need to be moving. Why am I taking cover against the zombie? Wait, let's see if we can run for it. Oh, God. That was close. Do I need to be looking behind me? Crap, they're all over. Come on, shoot the head. Ain't I almost out of ammo? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Click, click, click. What do? Oh. Well, that was cool. You're a nice shot. Run! Uh oh. Look at you. Why'd he leave the gun, though? The gun. The gun. I hate having to push buttons like that. Okay, the gun is mine. Oh, the gun has too much power. The knife, you have to do this up close. Now shank him. Yeah, I like this. This is awesome. I guess he's not ultimately bitter. Clem, get inside. Go. Clementine, are you okay? What the hell? Wait. Who has guns like that? to somebody and they come back pointing guns at you. Ain't that a bitch. Look at this place. I supposed to just sneak up on him and shank him? A lot of windows though. Fucking huge. Bill's gonna hate it. 
how the rest of them could be anywhere. What does it want me to do? Man, how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them too? Johnny, cover that window. Come on, there's going to be some bloodshed here. Deserves to be raised in a place of safety. I know you're out there, and Alvin, Luke, and the girl. This is real simple. You want this over quick. You all play nice and show your faces. <laughs> He'll kill him. No, Alvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. Back the baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Luke and Kenny? How the hell am I supposed to know? They're still outside. They can help us. We have to help Carlos. Only way to help him is to do what the man says. What about Luke and Kenny? Look at those guns. If he starts shooting, and people are gonna die on both sides. <laughs> Clint can sneak out. Find Luke. What the hell is she gonna do? And you heard him? Carver knows she's with us. Just stop! Don't hurt my dad, please! We're going well, down there. What's it gonna be? Kill you. Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! Clem, go get help. He'll kill him, Beck. He'll do it anyway. You don't know that. Say goodbye, Carlos. He's gonna kill him. Rebecca, we have to give up. Let these people go. Just shut up. Oh. 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 Clem, can you reach my hands? Everything under control? Clem. I'll try. E a little too risky there. Well, damn. Oh, Kenny. Here's your guard. Don't move. I can't see him. Watch them. Oh, damn! No! Walter! That's for our man! Now, I didn't want to do this! But you ain't leaving me much choice. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. Or well, you can give up now. Your choice. Uh, I guess that's his answer. Hi, Alvin. You motherfucker. Alvin! Bill, no! Tell him to stop! Kenny, stop! You remember George, Alvin? You see, I do. 
I remember a guy that was your friend named George. I remember when you murdered him in cold blood. And why? Because you didn't like me? You could have lodged a complaint. You could have... Well, you could have been civil. Bill, no! We'll do whatever you want! <laughs> Oh, that didn't work. Oh. And it might have got me messed night. up too. Is that what you want? Where's Luke? Finally cut and run, huh? Why am I not surprised? I warned you. I warned you not to follow him. Look where he's led you. But you're safe now. We're going home. As a family. All right, round him up. We're heading back to camp. Well, I guess we wasn't safe here for the night, was we? I want to see what happens next. Come on, show me a little scene. I wonder where Luke is. I know he didn't just leave us. I don't know if we could have saved Walt, but I know one of us didn't just give up. Yeah, I know. Folks are sore over what happened. But let's remember, these are our brothers and sisters, and they all have a vital role to play in this community. They strayed from the flock, yeah. That don't mean they can't earn their way back into the fold. That don't mean we can't find it in our hearts to forgive them, knowing full well. Those who choose not to accept our love, surely wish that they had. A storm is on the way. Well, okay, let's see what we got here. Took the blame for Sarah's photo. You and 41.5% of players took the blame. We just sit with the dinner. You and 65% of players sat with Kenny. Told Walter the truth about uh, about Matthew. 74% of people told the truth. Uh, you and 84.2% of players convinced Walter to forgive Nick. And let's see. You and 46% of players stayed to help Carlos. Most people tried to go help Kenny then. I... I I don't know. I was I was the wild card on at least two of these. <laughs> but I guess uh I'm going to have to cut it off at this part cuz it's like 40 minutes. Uh if you're new here, oh, this is going to go ahead and do its credit thing. If you're new here, I appreciate you watching this video and going through the entire thing. It is really good to be working on this series again. Uh it's not for everyone, but I like it. It's offers a, you know, a moment to just sit back and relax, even though it's still intense at times. But yeah, just go ahead and subscribe. There will be I will definitely be finishing this series now. And uh, for old subscribers and people who's been here for a while, hey, welcome back. It's it's good to see you again. But yeah, hopefully I'll have another part uploaded. I want I know it's a long shot if you if you've known me but I want to say it's going to be almost daily uploads so you're going to want to be around for that and my live streams I live stream kind of often on hitbox.tv forward slash epiphany so if you could just show up to those and whatnot that would be great and I'll see you guys in the next video